I'm going to try this. I have no clue if this will uh, work or not. Um, uh, this is actually the first time I've ever uh, pushed these things in or out or whatever. So, anyway, there's a flange on the bushing here, okay? Uh, the flange at the bottom there. So, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to push on the shaft on one side. That washer and everything, that should push that bushing out. Then you take the shaft and you go back the other way uh, it, to push the other one out, okay? Um, I'm going to see if it possibly works with a hammer. I have no clue if it will or not. Um, so let's see here. I'm using a heavy rubber one here because I don't want to uh, smash up the threads, but let's see if it even moves. Nope, I can't. Uh, it doesn't move in the... Because uh, uh, the rubber is just absorbing it. Okay, so I'm going to try one more thing here, and uh, we'll see if, uh, can you even see any of that? Not so much. Let's see if we can just tilt that up a little bit. Okay, this, this piece of metal just barely squeezes over the rubber there, but it would let the rubber go through. So let's see if we have it a little bit more solid. No, man, you can just feel that bounce. Okay, so uh, off to the uh, shop press we go. Okay, got to set up on the presser. Now, I had to get a little creative with the uh, plates here, okay, because I want to try to catch a support point on either side and out here. Um, so I'm in this small one here, and that seems to uh, catch a couple of corners there, okay, and then I've got the other one over here to support the other side. So I've got the air hooked up. Let's, uh, let's see uh, what it does. pushing hard holy cow I didn't think it'd be uh, near that hard pushing it out no wonder why I couldn't hammer it okay so I ran out of room here and I don't want to collapse my uh, arm so uh, I'm going to uh, open that back up and I've got uh, wow um, man that just barely fits okay so I've got an extension or a deep well socket here that's about the right uh, length so Let's uh, get it started with the uh, hand pump there and go from there. Yeah, that was nice and loud. Of course, it's round parts, so you know. Who knows where the hell they went? Okay, there's one with no bushings or washers. So I gotta at least find the washer so that I can turn it over and uh, um, oh, I guess that should work. I'll probably have to uh, turn this uh, turn these plates around here. Okay, that's kind of nice and it also looks like that might just go down through the middle there so Let's see if we can uh, get away with that. Let's make sure that goes down through the center there. There we go. Ooh, that... Uh... <laughs> and it would... It would not have slipped through there, so it's a good thing I uh, stopped when it... Uh came in contact. So I'll round up the bushings and uh, we'll go from there. thought I'd show this real quick. This is the one that pushed... This was the first washer, okay? Uh, so that was on top of the bushing that got pushed out first, okay? So that's the rubber pushing up and uh, bending that washer. Uh, there's the second one that just simply fell off uh, without any problems. So you can see that uh, that dome, that's at least an eighth of an inch. I'm basically just going to go put that in the shop press and squeeze it back down flat again. <laughs> 